In this video, we'll be going over 7.8 from Signing Naturally, describing scarves. So the first thing to know about this is that there are three steps in the sequence to describe a scarf. So the first one is to name an item and give the color if there's only one. The second is to describe the basic size and shape of the scarf. And the third is to describe the pattern and the details. This will be where the colors also come in as well if there's more than one color. Okay. So for the first one that I'm looking at here is more of a basic scarf. This one is kind of thinner, I'd say, and it is a blue color and it has fringes on both ends. So to start with, what will you sign? I hope you said scarf blue. So let's get started. So you can show the fringes on both ends. Actually, because it has fringes on both ends, I should do two hands, okay? Then another one that I have here is a black scarf with white dots on it. And it has, let's see, it says that it has red on the ends, but it's kind of hard to see from the picture. But it has red on it as well, okay? So I will sign... For the next one, this one has all different colors. This one looks like it's been crocheted or knitted. And on the end, it has these kind of like big giant, like a big pom-pom ball on each end. Okay, so let me sign this one. Okay, so I'll describe the horizontal stripes that are on the scarf using the C classifier like going across and then you'll have the two balls on the end of it. Okay, the next one is a plaid scarf. This one is yellow and green and white and it is a thinner scarf so because of that then I'm not going to use the C classifier to describe the thickness. I'm probably just going to use the B classifier just to show how it lays. Okay. So for this one, I'll sign. Okay, so for this one, notice that I did the contrastive structure, the roll shifting. So to the side, my non-dominant side, to the middle, to my dominant side for each of the colors. Okay. The next one that I have here is a scarf that is thinner. It has fringe on the ends, so around and then to about here is green, and then the rest of the way down is gray on both ends. So for this one, I'll sign. I'll sign it down here, but so you can see up here. Okay, so to describe the end parts are gray and the inside is green. So again, remember that the sequence for describing scarves is going to be the name of the item. So scarf and then the color if there's one or one main color. Describe the basic size and shape. So you can either use the C if it's a thicker one to show how thick it is here going down or it can be a thinner one that just lays. So you can use the B classifier if you'd like to use that one. And then you can also describe the pattern and the details, either by using a G classifier, by using the one for polka dots to show the different layers of color, or even the plaid. Keep up the great work. Bye.